Welcome everyone. Today we will use Mixemo animations on Cinti characters with the new 5.1 retargeting system. So first thing first, create a new folder, call it my game or the name of your game. Create a new one, animations. Then inside, create two folders, the animations for Mixemo and animations for your game or for Cinti. Inside Mixemo, we will create a new one called Rigs. And inside Cinti, we will call a new one called Rigs. So now go to Mixemo website, choose Yboat for the character here. Y bot, yes. Use this character. Download. Choose the typos. Now we'll take a first animation. For example, it'll breathe. So be sure to use it with the Y boat character and download it without skin. So now we will import it. So inside the Mixamo folder, just go grab your mesh. First, take the mesh. Do not specify any skeleton for it to be created. Then in advanced, be sure to tick the typos, then import it. You should then have the mesh, the basic mesh, then the Ybot skeleton. This is important. We have to keep the skeleton because we will use it afterward. So just save everything. Now inside Mixamo we can we can also create a new one animations so that we will keep our animations here. Take the brief idle animation. Then here select our Ybot skeleton import. And if you double click, you can see that it's applied to our mesh, so everything's working correctly. Save it, you can close it. Then we will do quite the same for the Cinti. Um, when you download, oh, sorry, when you download the Cinti package, you have a zip file. You just extract it, go to content, then select your polygon asset, drag and drop it inside your project, content, paste it here. Now we have our characters here in the mesh characters. Here you have the skeleton, yes, import. The Cinti skeleton, which is applied to every characters. So just rename it for my game skeleton or Cinti skeleton, yeah. Skeleton, so that we can find it more easily. All right, now we have to link the Mixamo with uh, the Mixamo animation with the Cinti character. For this, we have to create two rigs: one for Mixamo and one for the Cinti character. And then we will create a retargeter, which will. Um, transfer the animation from one rig to another another one. So let's go in the rig folder, create a new animation AK rig, select the Y boat, skeletal mesh, call it Mixamo rig. rig. Then we will have to set up every bones so let's go. The first one is the root. So set 
he set redarget root. Then we create also a new chain, which we call root. Don't put any goal. Then we will do the same for the other ones. The spine, check spine to spine two, create a new chain, call it spine. Neck and head go together, call it head. Then left shoulder, we will call it left clavicle. Then the arm, we take the arm until the end. We call it left arm. Then we will have to rig the wall, the wall hand. So the first one is the left thumb. No go. Then the left index. No go. The left middle. middle, the left ring, the left pinky, and the right clavicle. Middle, oops, right ring, and finally the right pinky. All right, for the leg, now it's easy. Left leg, no go. Right leg, select everything, no go. All right, this is our first rig. Then we do the same animation, AK rig, for our Sinti character. Uh, for this, you can select any skeletal mesh because it's the same uh, skeletal behind. So take the first one, call it Sinti rig. Then we do the same, but here in Sinti characters, you have a root bone, which doesn't appear inside the other, the Mixamo um, bones and skeletons. So we take the pelvis as the root. So it's set root, create the new root here. Okay. Then we do the same, the spine. No go the head, then the clavicle, right, uh, left clavicle, clavicle, then the left arm, left thumb, left index, and this one is the left middle. No go. Then we do the same with the other part, right clavicle. Right arm. Then right thumb. Right index, and right middle. Then the legs, 
right leg. Left leg. The AK you have here, you don't need to do anything with it. Just save it. Now we have the two rigs. Go to the Mixamo rig and we will create the animation retargeter here, IK retargeter. We take from source the Mixamo rig. Mixamo retargeter. And now as the target, we will take our Sinti rig. You can put some offsets to see what you're doing. And now save it. If we take the animation here in the asset browser, we, we can see that the animation is properly sent to the other side, except you can see the fits. They are moving from the floor because the root is not set properly inside the Sinti character here. Here you see the feet are st stuck on the floor and here they are moving. This is simple. We just get into the chain ma mapping. Then the root, we set it to none. And then you can see that the feet are properly put on the floor. So now how can we apply the animations to be able to use it into the animation blueprint? We go into the Sinti uh, mix some more animations. Uh, first, create a Sinti folder with animations. Animations. Go to the animations we have from Mixamo. Right click, retarget, duplicate. Then we take our Mixamo retargeter. We put maybe a Sinti prefix. Change it to the folder we just created. Animations, Sinti animations and then retarget. And then we see, just save it, we see that our animations has been properly added to our character. And now if we want to use it, just create a new animation blueprint with the uh, Sinti skeleton. Create Sinti anim. And you have now the animation that we just created. If you compile, you can see that is it's applied properly. And now if you want to create and to import a new animation, it's super easy. Just go to your animations, go back to the website. If we take another animation, for example, this one, download it. Be sure to download it with the Yboat skeleton. So download it without skin. Then it's not here. Yes, here we are. Just drag and drop it. And the skeleton selects the Y boat because we import the animation for the Y boat. Import it. And now, as we already did the retargeter, it's super easy. Just right click, retarget, select our Mixamo retargeter, Sinti. Change it to our folder, Sinti animations, and retarget. And here we are. We have the animation properly set up for the, our character. And if you go to the animation blueprint, you can remove this one and use the new one we just created. So I hope you enjoyed. I hope it helped you. See you next time.